up guys iTech Pro here and I'm back with another video so you guys remember that earlier in February error 53 grabbed plenty of attention with an impending fix waiting in the wings for those affected by the issue a fix is coming sooner than expected so yesterday Apple has issued an update to iOS 9.2.1 which the build number is 13d20 and the previous build was 13d15 for users that update their device through iTunes only this update is meant to directly restore phones that were previously bricked or otherwise made unusable by error 53 while it fixes currently bricked devices it will also prevent devices that are repaired by third party sites from getting disabled as well so guys this is not a new version of iOS but rather just a patch to the already available iOS 9.2.1 Apple plans on issuing an updated support page for error 53 at some point yesterday which will articulate repair methods and causes for error 53 in a statement to the publication Apple apologized for the inconvenience that the error caused this update will not re-enable Touch ID as that information is stored within the secure enclave which works as a private key to keep that information safe and inaccessible from even Apple if Apple were to allow that piece of functionality to get repaired by third parties it would be a security risk that Apple is clearly not willing to take if Touch ID is something that you want then you will need to get the device repaired at Apple this is a step in the right direction especially with a fix being delivered so promptly Apple was hit with a class action lawsuit over error 53 with that case still in the system even with Apple's fix now available so guys Apple has released iOS 9.2.1 build 13d20 update for only iPhone 6, 6 plus, 6s and 6s plus and also iPad Air 2 and iPad mini 3 I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video if you enjoyed it please give me the thumbs up and subscribe so you can beat Apple and peace out.